The supremacy and unity of the party should be the guiding principle as the People's Democratic Party aims for the victory at the Bayelsa Central Senatorial Election in the state. It was Governor Doye Derry's charge to the faithful of the PDP after a former chairman of the party, Moses Cleopas, emerged candidate for the Bayelsa Central Senatorial Election. Joseph Kunde reports. Delegates converge on the peace pack for the screening exercise. They move to the Gabriel Okara Cultural Center, the venue for the Bayelsa Central Senatorial Primary. Hereby withdraw. Three aspirants withdrew from the race before the exercise commenced. Accreditation, voting, sorting and counting of ballots done the former chairman of the People's Democratic Party, Moses Cleopas, emerged as the senatorial candidate with 428 votes. By virtue of the authority conferred on me as the returning officer, I hereby return Moses Cleopas as the winner of the Central Senatorial District Primary Elections. I am prepared in my heart to we'll have PDP spread. If there's one thing we need to do now, get our people back on track. I know that from the beginning, the process itself was compromised and orchestrated, tailored towards a particular favored candidate. And so I took it to the end, courageously. The important thing that party comes first. So my decision to step aside was for the interest of the party that we are a one united party that is ready to win election. I, Senator Doye Diri. The Bayelsa central seat became vacant in the Senate when Doye Diri emerged governor of Bayelsa State. He is also a delegate at the senatorial primary. All of us, it is first of all the supremacy of the party and the unity of the party. And so there will be no loser there will be no winner. In PDP, we carefully select, nominate our candidates. And so you will see the difference between the candidate that will emerge from the PDP and any other party. The emergence of Moses Clovers as candidates makes the Bayosa Central context even more exciting with the People's Democratic Party hoping that the Colombo-born politician will win the election on the 31st of October. Joseph Kunde. TVC News, Yanagoa.